and 10 second initiation retro. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to bypass Bloom security doors and get inside. Then find and erase your personal CTOS profile. Whatever they have on me, it's all bullshit. And I'm sick of getting harassed for it. All the more reason for a purge. We'll be watching. Try to keep up. By the way, we put this playlist together to set the mood. Hope you like it. You're wasting your time. He's not in. Gotcha. So that's him. He's got a gun. Is that a problem? Well, problem is why you keep me around, right? Time him. I'm curious. Too late. He's in. Already? Don't say I don't know. I have no idea. Nuh -uh. No synonyms either. Give me a real answer. I'm just not that into aliens or video games. It's not just any alien. It's oh come on. Anyone else having a problem with their phone? Oh god, oh god! Ah! 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 Deal. He was raised in Oakland, but was born in... <laughs> His deal is, he's been hanging around the DedSec IRC, and he's got cred. Figured we'd give him a test drive. On the hardest difficulty, nobody's been able to delete their CTOS profile before. I want to see if he's smart, stubborn, or both. Service, not enough evidence. 
just the word of CTOS's predictive algorithms. But once in the system, always in the system. Shit, I need help. Take cover. Holy shit. <laughs> he went for it. You won't have much time before the backups kick in. Going in the hot aisle. It's at least 120 degrees in there. Give the man props. It's going the mile. Nobody's gotten that far. This is like the secret cow level. Why is my threat so high? This is bullshit. could just I'm gonna drop a little back door into the system so I can get back inside later. Sorry, Bloom. We've got unfinished business. He's heading out. Bag him. Yeah. Come on, go. Josh! Okay, okay. Fuck! 
Fuck you, Bloom. In 2013, Chicago realized the promise of smart cities with CTOS, a citywide operating system merging big data with surveillance, security, and transit programs. With a few hundred lines of code, hackers were able to hijack its central servers and cripple the entire grid. Many believed the attack would be a killing blow for smart city development. They were wrong. Coordinated from the heart of Silicon Valley, CTOS 2.0 has been implemented across the United States, ushering in the Internet of Things. 6.4 billion connected devices now serve as collection points, mapping and recording our daily routines, making a more secure and more invasive system. But who else is listening? Big Brother no longer works alone. Thousands of little brothers monitor and aggregate your every move building a complete digital profile of you to be bought, sold, or stolen in an instant. Toys study your children, reporting their play habits back to marketers. Appliances, consoles, and home security systems give corporations a window into your private life. Control of your vehicle and mobile device can now be breached remotely by anyone at any time. You may think that you are immune or underestimate the risk, but your digital shadow is already compromised. Insurance companies use algorithms to monitor your life habits and limit or deny coverage. Health providers determine if your cancer is worth treating. Search results and news feeds are skewed to bias mood and influence your vote, engineering social uprisings on a massive scale. You are now less valuable than the data you produce. Data you produce. This is the new reality. Going dark is no longer an option. With threats to personal freedom rising, many are stepping forward. Whistleblowers, activists, and hackers have drawn their battle lines, putting the establishment on watch. But are they threats themselves, or have they become freedom's last line of defense? Freedom's last line of defense. So? Am I in? Welcome to DedSec. I'm Satara. This sweetheart is Josh, AKA Hot Sauce. Yo, you're Hot Sauce? Yo, yeah, man, I loved your frat house hat. Real talk. Thanks. This weirdo's wrench. The needs of the many. And this Casanova is Horatio. What's up, brother? Man. It's the crew, huh? Took y'all long enough to come get me. Shit. You saw Bloom's bullshit. CTOS isn't just regulating infrastructure. The amount of personal data that thing is collecting is fucking mind-blowing. Yeah. It's Big Brother and Little Brother all rolled up into one. Huh? Sees everything you do and tells on you. Thank you, Josh. So what's the fix? Sledgehammers and fire. No! Sledgehammers on fire. Oh, sorry. <laughs> All that data in one place means they can reject your fucking application before you click on it. <laughs> Congratulations, you have been free rejected for our credit card. Or your house, or your insurance. That's not even the worst case scenario. All that data in the hands of the government? They'll arrest you for shit before you even do it. Yeah, I've been there. Now I fucking know why. Man, f fuck it! Fuck it, man. We're hackers. We, we out think, we out dare. I, I say we tear down the fucking wall. Hey, show everyone what, what Bloom's up to, man. Show, show the world that their personal data is being used to rob them of their fucking freedoms. Fuck. I installed a back door, so all we gotta do is walk right through. Uh, hold on. You what? He installed the back door, so all we have to do is walk through. Bingo. Hey, man. Do you have the time? Oh, yeah, man. 
I got it. I got it. Kind of late for a night run, isn't it? Hey, what, are you, what are you running from the cops? <laughs> Maybe I am one. Hey, hey you, you look familiar. <laughs> Have a good party. King, this mother. Fuck you, Bloom. I'm gonna go have a goddamn good time. Whose phone is this? It's your new phone. Where is my phone? In the ocean, where you threw it, I think. I don't remember. I was pretty smashed. Look, meet us at the hacker space. Where? Check your pics and figure it out. Guess I was lit, huh? <laughs> like Mardi Gras. Go get yourself something to wear, and I'll tell you where to go next. Oh, and you'll need your phone ready for operations. So hit the store and download your apps before you get here. Damn, walk of shame on my first day.
they All right, Sitar. So where you at? Sending you the location and the passcode for the door. I don't know. I, I, I sometimes I want to feed them, but I don't have enough food to do that. I feel sorry for them. They smell too.
Yo! Finally. So Josh and I spoke, and fucking over Bloom has been a long-standing project. All right, you need two things to take down Bloom. You need to get people to rally behind your cause to separate you from the trolls. And we need bots, and a lot of them to handle the data CTOS is processing. Thank you, Josh. We spent all night modifying our app so you can get followers to download the app, and we can use their processing power for the cause. This is happening? It's really happening, mm -hmm. man. This is happening. You better get to it. Hell yeah, man! Barbarians are at the gate and ready to bust some Roman heads. Yeah, we're gonna focus on some high-profile ops, play them for exposure and laughs to get people to download our app. Mm -hmm. All right. Don't worry. That wasn't my phone. <laughs> Marcus! <laughs> Check you out. Alive and dry. I wasn't sure after your moonlight swim. Come here. You've got to check this out. Behold, our very own open source. Okay. What, what, it of technology a 3d printer this is the army of printers it is capable of pumping out an arsenal of lethal weapons down seriously yep once you master it voila hipster merchant of death all good except i'm no hipster <laughs> you keep telling yourself that now try to make something but don't blow us up Good to have another brother here. <laughs> good to, yeah, and good. What about you? Tactic, you heard? It's something, right? This whole place is something. We used to keep track of news feeds on here, but now it's our follower wall. So it knows if we're trending? No, no, no. It's based on hard values. How many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we have access to, you know. Nice. And, speaking of which, we're downloading the DeadSec app into your phone as we speak. 
When it's ready, open it up, click the suggested op, and hit the park outside so we can test it. Sounds good. One more thing. I put a reminder on your phone so you remember what we're gunning for. Get enough processing power to take down Blue. Spiritual organization New Dawn is accusing Oakland City Councilor Miranda Kamei of defamation. In a recent interview, the councilor had described the organization as, quote, a fraudulent pyramid scheme. The organization seems to have fought back with more than just lawyers. The councilor's private life was recently revealed when medical records of the councilor's transgender treatments were mysteriously released to the media. A spokesperson for New Dawn said that the organization had nothing to do with the leaked medical records and in her statement accused Councillor Kamei of desperately seeking attention. The app's downloaded and I'm in the park. What am I testing? Start profiling things around you. People, devices. See what you can pull from them. That's what helps us figure out our next ops. And running ops that are important to people is how we get them interested in DedSec. 
The more followers download our app, the more intel we get. It's the circle of life. Oh, and see if you can find some components to help us with our research. Keep Don't let the people, Don't let the app is your data mining tool. Of death. Okay, okay, I... Hey, so what's this about? You know Bobo's working on a new app? Yeah, I heard. Well, you won't get to hear it? Motherfucker Gene Carcaney just put millions on the table to keep it all to himself. What does a big pharma CEO want? Dude has a huge... Do you know if Bobo took the... He hasn't announced... And maybe there's time for... I assume you guys have heard of Gene Carcani. He's the shit sack who's on TV laughing about how he's raising the price of leukemia medicine. Yeah, the most hated man in America? Yeah, why do you ask? Guy's a huge Bobo Dakes fan. Must have read Bobo's in town recording new tracks because he's offering millions to keep the album to himself. So stupid. Bobo will never go for it. The real one won't. So we're gonna do it for him. I'm gonna visit Bobo and see if I can borrow some of his new tracks as proof that we're legit. How do we contact Karkani? I need you guys to run through interviews, podcasts, whatever. Find me some usable lines. We're gonna make a soundboard. Cool, I love this. Marcus, guys, the Cyber Driver trailer just dropped. Oh, yeah, sweet. Hey, don't watch it without me. <laughs> Meet you at the hackerspace. I'm on my way. Retro, we got some primate thug terrassing around the city. Shit, cops doing anything about it? They're trying. Why don't you show them how it's done? I've got a new Bobo track the world has never heard before. How's the soundboard coming? Yo, a Bobo date, bitch. <laughs> Perfect. So, how do we contact Karkani? I'm gonna visit his mansion. I need to see his face when we do this. Yeah. 
Time to mess with the farmer clown. This ass face deserves it. Hello? Sup? Uh, sup? Who is this? Holy shit. I'm a huge fan. Are you taking me up on my offer? Yeah, I laid down some hot tracks. Really? Fantastic. Yup. Can I get a sample? Born raised, born crazy. Hate and blow the fuck away. Real a monkey. Hate the hero. Fuck the story. Don't go out in a blaze of glory. Break my face. Tell a Bobo sent you. Damn. That's dope. That's your best work yet. You're welcome. And this is exclusive, right? No one else gets this, just me? Yup. So how do you want payment? The bitch better have my money. I do. I just need to know how to route it to you. Y'all, check it. Ah, there. That's the routing number? Yup. Uh-huh. Sent and confirmed. You got it. This is awesome, man. This is like a dream come true. Yo, bitch. Bobo Dakes. What? They say God made man in his own image. But God made himself in Bobo's image. What are you talking about? Yo, bitch. Bobo Dakes. No. No. No, 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 no. Oh, what the shit? doing to me? Why me? Come on! I'm a good guy! It's just business! I got shareholders, bitches! <laughs> Guys! Guys, he just, he just donated 20 million to leukemia research. <laughs> Bitch better have my money. <laughs> Yo, who did that? Get lost. Ah. What the fuck was that for? Hi, I need an ambulance. It's an emergency. Coming up after the break, we'll be sitting down with a former street artist. Sweet T, as he's known in the community, is here to promote a new book.
Congrats, Marcus. Our follower count is growing fast. How many are actually giving us access to their computers? All of them. That's the point. They give us access to their power. We grow a network of computers that makes us stronger. Our own giant cloud computing network. So do people sign a contract? I vow to let DedSec own my processor? We're transparent. They know before they ever install the app that they're giving us access to their computing power, but never their personal info. That's a lot of trust. Silicon Valley would kill to have that level of intrusion. Private data farming runs their whole economy. Yeah, but we look out for our own, man. That's why people are joining our movement. To make a statement against the technocrats. Hey, Marcus, have you seen the trailer for the new Jimmy Siska movie? No, it's out. Hey, hey, pull it up, no, no, man. No, no, not on this. For this, we need perfect sound. We need a big screen. We need to be comfy. Right. We need quiet. Have you seen it yet? No, man. I waited for you. You're the best. Thank you. All right, everybody, we're going to watch the trailer. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. In a world where technology connects everything. I'm not looking for justice, goddammit. One man prowls the information superhighway. In search of cyber justice. I'm looking for cyber justice. Simple line of code could devastate the whole world. It's gonna be a cyber caster. Cyber Driver. Hit him with the code for a chip. Jimmy Siska is. Got no choice, kiddies. Follow me, or die. Devon Von Devon. We gotta get these hackers somewhere safe. They aren't hackers, Devon. They're just script kiddies. Hey, the car answered. This ain't your mama's smart car. I think next time we're gonna need a higher firewall, pal. Cyber, Cyber Driver. Action hero, badass. Talking car. A admit it, Josh. The car is cool. You know what I'm thinking? We cut our own version of that trailer. And that car is gonna help us do it. For real? HMP Studios, we are holding you solely responsible. You guys thought that movie was gonna be good? <laughs> well, yeah, sure. They're fun to laugh at. Cool, you said. Uh, did I actually say cool? Here's what we know, Josh. Cyber Driver is shaped up to be a million dollar cyber catastrophe. I know you're trying to get my goats with that word. Uh, I don't want that, man. Keep your goats. Why would Galileo allow their name to be 
sullied. You mean cyberized? You can keep trying, but it will never be funny to me. I'm not gonna lie. If those scenes were what they chose for the trailer, yeah, the rest of it's gonna be jack shit. And why they chose to target DeadSec is curious. Well, Chicago was a big deal. True. Anyway, don't worry. You and me are prowling the information highway to seek out our own cyber justice. Look, Josh, we're gonna have fun with this. And I promise I won't say cyber anymore. You know, after this, the cyber world will never be the same. <laughs> And there it is, Hook Motion Picture Studios. Okay, guys, I'm in. Here we go. Nice. The not so secret emails. We're uh, running out of organic kills and we've got the craft table. Can you please send out one of the PAs to fetch some more? I found it. We got the full script to Cyberdriver. What about the car? I don't think it's on site. We'll find it. I'm heading out now. No way. What did you say? I can't understand you. Oh, come on. Get lost. No one cares. Oh. Help. 
Hey guys, I found an email that says the car is being delivered to a location, but it doesn't say where or when. That's okay. I think I have a backup plan. I have a paparazzi contact who knows where the car is. He's waiting for you. We'll give him whatever he asks for out of that email dump. He's good for it. Sure. You have a paparazzi contact? <laughs> is there anyone you don't know? That's me. Social butterfly. They're stuck in there for over an hour, fighting over this <laughs> What do you think oh, about the current cute. state of affairs? Mission burritos, right? Jesus, you're brave. That's like discussing politics. Oh, I know, right? So oh. oh, wow. That's my bad. I I'm so sorry.
If you want deets on where the car is at, better like Jimmy Siska and pop star Nelly Shire. My bad. Sorry. I need some help here! Be advised, we have reports of previously identified target near your location. Over. Well, I'm authorizing myself, motherfucker. Wrench, you hear this? The car's talking. Locking him off now. Squad, this is BH2. We're on the scene. We spotted the Dispatch, can you run a check? Got a patrol this car. one of the movie suspect. Face is too dark for my sensors to read. What? Bitch, I'm black and I'm proud. Tell your sensors to calibrate that. I have no reference for black. No, of course you don't. Be advised, the boots are on route to the suspect's location. Keep your hands and feet inside the tornado at all times. Hang on to your innards, Devin. Together, we will carve up the streets. Wait, did you just say a line from the movie? Wrench, you hearing this? I am one nitrous jacked smart car. Squad, we've lost visual on the suspect. We'll pick him up when he exits the tunnel. Be advised, a patrol car has been Well, wait, did, did you just say the car quoted the movie? Yeah. <laughs> that is so meta. Where the hell did he go? Ah. Hey. Squad, we're on site and starting our search. 
Stand by. We're swinging back around. I'm clear. Meet you at the garage. On my way. I am Devin Von Devin, and I am... You are not Devin. Devin Von Devin is handsome and swarthy. <laughs> you are not. Oh, come on. I'm sure as hell swarthier than any dude named Von Devin. Damn, Silicon Valley couldn't hire one. My Galilei creators think of everything. Yeah, maybe not everything.
this card. This car is something else. Yeah, well, kudos to Galilee for getting the studio to pay for this lemon. Lemon? Did you hear it? And never mind voice recognition. I mean, sure, it needs a smack of sided scripting, but it had cogent responses. Do you know how much work had to go into that? Uh, Galilee has been talking about machine learning for their Mars probe, but, man, I didn't expect it to be as advanced as it... What? Oh, man. Oh, I know it! <laughs> I do not approve of you driving me, Marcus. You are not as swarthy as Evan Von Devon. I knew it had too much smart ass to be smart. Wow. Shiny and new. So it wasn't responding at all? Well, does, um... Does, does that count? Yeah, fuck you, man. Fuck you. <laughs> the car's designed for autonomous control, but nothing's there or even calibrated. It's capable, but suboptimal. Not junk. See? That's what I'm talking about. Think positive. It's just stupid. So that's the plan? Fix a smart car the space company couldn't? Problem? No, we got this. Hmm. <laughs> Retro, feel like stealing some primate intel? You got something for me? One of their lackeys in your neck of the woods. Hack them for what they've got, but make sure you don't get caught. You know how primate do.
Move! Please, hey, don't do... Somebody, do something! Suspect. 